Well, Fulton County Schools are facing a financial crisis due to a delay in property tax collection. Now, the school superintendent says that could lead to closures at the beginning of next school year. Fox News Dieter Dukes has reaction from parents who just learned of the district's dilemma today. Yeah, this is very troubling to say the least. Now, school officials say that they are headed to court seeking relief on Friday, but that if the judge does not rule in a way that has tax revenue coming their way by December 15th, everything is on the table, including schools closing. You know, in the end, we don't want the kids to be hurt. That's the part that is very worrisome as a parent. Growing concern for parents who learn Tuesday the Fulton County property tax dispute has left the Fulton County School District facing a dramatic financial shortfall. Call it a domino effect. After the delay in collection of property tax revenue following controversy over initial tax assessments earlier this year, the school district learned last week their share of the revenue was being held up because the Georgia Department of Revenue did not approve Fulton County's tax digest. Letters went out to parents spelling out the situation Tuesday. To know that you know the funding is not available and that can hurt them education-wise, um, activities. A lot of kids look forward to these activities, so it's concerning as a parent. Fulton Schools will join Atlanta Public Schools and Fulton County Government in court on Friday, seeking a temporary collection order which would allow Fulton County to collect taxes. In the meantime, the school district has taken immediate cost-saving moves, including moving December 20th payroll to December 29th freezing hiring district-wide, placing a moratorium on out-of-system travel, including staff conferences, and implementing a process to review student field trips to limit district costs. I'm here right now to pick up my son from basketball practice. And so if they talk about cutting programs, they talk about, you know, cutting travel for out-of-county, you know, that's, that's, that's difficult to hear. Now, the superintendent stressed the lack of funds is directly related to the Fulton County Board of Commissioners vote to freeze property tax value at 2016 levels and that the school district has exercised appropriate and prudent spending. Russ? All right. We'll see what happens on Friday. Deidre, thanks.